Hello again. I just wanted to uh, go through something very simple real fast that uh, because I ran into a problem and I know that a lot of people will run into, you know, the same type of thing with the stock head bolts. Um, if you ever get into a motor where you want to increase the compression, um, like we did with our head over here, um, one of the things is that um, this head gasket is quite a bit thicker than the one that we have on there. It's about twice as thick and we milled down the head a little bit to increase the compression. The problem with these is you can only go so far on the head bolts with these. Um, let me switch hands here. If you look, I'd be bottom. I mean, I'd be topping out on this head bolt, this acorn nut that came with it. And with that, I'd be blowing air out the top. So something that I like to do is I like to, you know, go over my local hardware store. It's only, it only costs a dollar. Um, I got a lot more, uh, they're a lot stronger. It's I think 8.8 .8 tensile strength. And I, I don't know what these can handle, but I know that a lot of people have problems with them stripping out or, you know, getting stuck on the head studs if they tighten them down too much. And uh, it'll get to the point where it won't turn anymore and you can, you know, possibly strip out your head stud or break your head stud, which is not a repair that you want to do. So what I just like to do is I like to get these and just upgrade them. And, you know, it doesn't look as good as that when it's on there. But I think the that they'll last quite a bit longer. You can take them on and off without them stripping out. And it's just something that uh, will help you, you know, keep your motor together. Like I said on my last video, increase longevity of your motor. It's just a, a good upgrade that's really cheap uh, just to make sure that your motor keeps running. Make sure you don't... Uh, have some compression loss by, you know, an air leak at the very top, which can be very bad in the sense that you could be sucking in air from the outside of, I mean, on top of your cylinder wall. And this will just, uh, you know, make sure the motor stays together and make sure the head stays down tight. And, you know, it's one of those things that real cheap and, you know, real quick fix, but it lasts forever. It's just something that's, you know, good to keep in mind whenever you're getting into the motor itself.